So Baltimore is a food city. You know, it's been turning into a food city for the last you know ten or so years, and and it's a great city uh, to to eat. And more and more chefs uh, have ideas they want to try out, and so so we really wanted to create a launch pad for chefs, and and uh, and that's how it all kind of started. Seawall Development's been in Remington for a while now. We love it, and uh, we had been approached uh, by a bunch of different community members really wanting food and beverage. Um, so we wanted to put our spin on it. You know, I think Mediterranean cuisine is unique, healthy, delicious. Um, it's the food that I was born and raised on. I think people are excited. I think they're embracing it for its health and its taste um, component. Our house has been awesome. The guys at Seawall Development have really produce an awesome and unique venue for Baltimore. I have a lot of connections within the community, especially with a lot of uh, local farms and urban farms. And I think bringing that to Remington now makes it a little bit more special. Um, the community doesn't really have that many um, outlets for food. And with us being here and with our house, it kind of gives them, you know, the neighborhood spot that they always wanted. Yeah, the taco restaurant is, um, is a really authentic Mexican street taco uh, concept. We have our chef, Claudia Santillan, who is from Mexico. Uh, she basically brought all of her family recipes um, to this place here at our house and is really just producing the food that she's grown up with and is used to making uh, in Mexico. We get every type of person here at our house, um, from local artists to families, from the county. Um, really everybody comes and just hangs out. Uh, I think what I see most people doing is coming in and checking out each stall one by one and getting something little at each at each place, which is kind of the perfect thing to do here. Our house has, has, has shown us all that a concept of, of you know this size can flourish. Uh, a tremendous amount of people have been coming in and it just shows that the need for kind of pushing the uh, envelope on, on food concepts is, is in this city and uh, it's been a smashing success.